from Ram's Head Center Stage at Maryland Live. This is Poker Night in America. Welcome to Poker Night in America. I'm your host, Chris Hansen. Tonight, we continue our cash game series in the Ram's Head Center Stage at Maryland Live. We've got some notable faces at the table, including Phil Helmuth, Greg Merson, and then some guy named Dumpster Joe. It must be trash day because all this guy's been doing is collecting. Let's take a look at the chip you counts. Put it on you there. It's like Tom. Day one yeah, chip stacks continuing I on here. Two winners and a bunch of losers I thus far. Tom Schneider and local Joe Butts have been dominating the table thus far here in Maryland. Nah, that's a hard decision to make with 1,800 in front of you. And that is dumpster Joe Butts sitting just to the left of Phil Helmuth. Oh my God, Joe, are you commenting on poker play now too? No. It's one thing to listen to you make fun of me just every hand. It's the money. another thing That's if you want to enter our, our arena. Here, we'll put 2,000 up on the side. Here, we'll play the hand blind. Let's I'm sure gamble like a little bit. All right, well, uh, I'm not a gambler, I'm a poker player. All right. I'm more of a gambler. <laughs> I'm, not a, I'm, I'm, I'm not a poker player. player. I've, I've proven that. I'm not a poker player, I'm a gambler. I have proven that I am not a poker player. I don't listen. Listen, Joe. I don't mind you. I don't mind you making fun of me. I just, I wasn't making fun of you. I was just no asking you. Oh, you're not going to let me talk at all. Well, go ahead. When you're done, I'm let sorry. me talk. <laughs> I don't mind you trying to make fun of me and all this little, all these little games. But please don't comment on poker. I didn't comment on poker. I commented on an $1,800 stack. It's kind of hard to fold with a top pair, isn't it? 1,800 bucks? Nope. All right. Yeah. You see, you're wrong again too. I didn't have eight. I didn't say I was right. I didn't say I was right. You seem like a nice guy, Joe. I you am a nice guy, I am, and me. sir, I am allowed to say whatever I would like to say. That was not offensive. Well, it's nice to see that Phil Helmuth and Dumpster Joe have a nice relationship, buddy. I, I, I got some nice ones on my breakout. Schneider with absolutely they nothing, have, have, fires 1,500 uh, on the turn. I just threw them on. When you get a little bit older, you get the ones where you have the, like, the reader part on the bottom. Check blind, sir. The line in the middle, the magic. <laughs> let's, let's, let's see if a spade comes so out there. I can see my cards down here. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm just tired in the, these 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 bright lights, man. I'm yeah, cracking under the, the cracking under the pressure. For sure. And Schneider's going to take one more swing at this pot. Newtons. Newtons. Okay. And the correct call from Dumpster Joe. I think mine might be eight hundred. Might have to be Interesting that Tom Schneider showed his bluff right. there. Dumpy. Dump Where's your? Where are you from? Phoenix. Uh, they have they have this tournament, uh, the Arizona State Championships. It's kind of cool. Oh, it's a good one. One yeah. K buy-in, one million guaranteed prize pool. Greggy. And you can play each starting day. They're like three starting yeah. days. Yeah. All that. Uh, Greggy won like eight million. One million guaranteed. Yeah, what is this? My bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Greggy won eight million. He's like, one yeah. million guaranteed, whatever. Yeah, what's first place? Uh, well, he's like, yeah, if I'm guaranteed to win the entire prize pool, maybe I'll play. Yeah. <laughs> Can we just play for it all? Put it yeah, together? Yeah, right. Put it, all, put it together, yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys have got me. Joe, you got me on, uh, you got me. You got like, <laughs> three steaming now. Three seven figure cashes out of 15 total. I might, I might have yeah, to um, suit a ace for Brian well, Hastings. Good enough for a call. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to loosen up oh, my standards just a little bit. Yeah, yeah. This seems hard to believe, doesn't it? Yeah, Greggy came up to visit me in the Bay Area, Robert. Did he? I had him on the floor of the Warriors game. Marc Gasol was at the free throw line with a minute left in the game, Robert. You can't make this up. He's at the free, he's, he's getting ready to get a rebound. He's looking over at Greg going like this. No, uh, really? Yeah. That's pretty and then cool. I looked at him because I thought he was looking at him, but he was talking to the owner. So I don't know if he was doing it to me because of him or because, because of me. Or both. I don't know. Or both. It doesn't well, yeah. matter. Both. Either yeah. way, it's both. really cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, hang out with Phil in public, it happens to No, both. but it really was. It was, Ferguson. It was a tie game with, with a minute and a half in the fourth quarter. Yeah, and, the, and he's wow. looking at Greg yeah. going like this. Yeah, that's pretty <laughs> funny. Well, they were playing Memphis, huh? Uh, oh, the rest of that story. Yeah, they were playing Memphis. Yeah. Russell Thomas Russell. checks his two right, pair sorry, back to DePaulo. Right? And the rest of that story, Robert, uh, Mike Miller comes over. 
and uh, says, hey, nice to see you. Phil shakes my hand. He's throwing the ball in with a minute, two minutes left in the game. And then, uh, hey, nice to meet you. And then he reaches over to shake Joe Lacob's hand, the Warriors owner. Joe says, I'm not shaking your hand. And part of me just loved it, because he's so competitive. He's never beat Memphis. I'm like, why didn't you shake his hand? He's like, we never beat Memphis. And then Joe's girlfriend is saying, Joe, Wow. Mike Miller's a good guy, he played for Miami, we like him. And Joe's like, we never beat Memphis. So I like that warrior attitude of his, you know. Did you buy a boat in, uh, in Las Vegas, buddy? No. Did I see you out there all relaxed? Oh, uh, we just rented a boat. On a lake, yeah. Yeah. That lake's sick. That's an ice lake. I like yeah, that that's my first time ever going to it. You had a good time out there? Yeah. I've never done it in all these. Trevor Pope was out there with with uh, Bilzerian's brother, and and they had that jetpack. Uh, oh, oh no, that, that thing, thing looks so thing? cool. Yeah. Oh god, things. I've always wanted that. And Trevor oh. is like a master on it. He can do all these tricks and stuff. So he took uh, my girlfriend and Chris Claude Nicky's girlfriend for rides on it. Did you get up? No. <laughs> no. Sir, we had to get, try. We had to get them all with twin engines. <laughs> <laughs> I, I went tubing <laughs> for the first try. time. Yeah, yeah. And I, I got I got blasted. This is a good site for you guys to picture. 1,200 from we Thomas met up here Denver. on the river. He's floating oh. in the air on this thing. And he's actually really good. And then he's uh, doing Viffer? he's doing dolphin dives. What? Like a Viffer with no shirt on, just like floating in the air. Well, first of all, <laughs> like, that's hilarious. a scary thought of Viffer with yeah. no shirt. And then him, him doing nice dolphin enough. dives yeah. into the water. All yeah. from the hollow. Are you serious? He yeah. was doing dolphin dives? Yeah. Nice hand. Thanks. We've got more from Ram's Head Center Stage here at Maryland Live when we return. Poker Night in America is being brought to you by 888poker.com, where the world plays online. Welcome back to Poker Night in America. Let's get back to the action. Two main event winners at this table. Poker Night in America That's is brought to you by 888poker, you guys played out or no? where the world plays online. He lost. Good job. He lost. lost. I mean, how amazing I is that? Uh, it's it's always if you chop and win, I won. If you chop and lost, I chop. Well, he, yeah, because I chopped the 25, the PCA. He, he, he had 2.8, I had 2.5. But everyone's so he, always like, you got second. I'm like, no, I chopped. He, he had 2.8, I had 2.5, so we agreed on even chop, but he gets the trophy. Yeah. Oh, you didn't even run the board? No. Uh, what? That's stupid. No, no, no. He had 2.8 million. I, I had 2.5. He had Carter had two eight. I, I, th I thought you saw oh, okay. it even. Yeah, I mean, almost even. even yeah. yeah. Oh, cool. Okay, I see. That. But he got but the trophy. He got the trophy. Uh, I thought I thought he was like two eights versus two fives, <laughs> and then we chopped. Tom Schneider picks up a flush draw on the turn. He's in his picture because he had the Clyde, Clyde Jackson jersey on, and I thought the Apollo was all in. I didn't. I didn't do it every once. Once or twice. Twice, twice, twice. twice is fine. Twice is good. You got, you got anything yet? Twice? I do. All right, let's one turn up. Yeah, of course. Oh, no, that sucks. Twice. <laughs> something. Can I bet on Tom to skip this? Thanks, Greg. Sure. I mean, you can vote for the little guy. Vote for the little guy. All right, that's good. That's good news for you. I'm alive. I'm alive. Nice, Sam. Just right. like that, Phil that's Call is going to double up. Nice, Sam, Phil. Thank you. No yeah, diamond. Greg, what now, huh? I'm not rooting against you. Come on, Greg. <laughs> yeah, no. You should have seen me yesterday, man. I was calling with nothing. I had this is tighter play today. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I, I want to see more of Phil Helmuth and Dumpster Joe going at one another. Am I alone in that fact? Breathing life back into me. CPR. Queens for Hastings. You are the doctor. I know. It's funny. It's, it's, it's an academic doctor, but uh, I'm still a paramedic, so I guess I counts. Consultology. Tonsiltology. Tonsiltology, you like that? Is that uh, helping remove people's tonsils? Is that not, not tonsiltology, consultology. Come on. If you're going to say it on national TV, you got to say it right. Consultology. Consultology. Oh. That's what you're a doctor of? It's a healthcare IT Is that consulting. Removing My people's grandfather was also a consultologist. Robert, are you? No, he got wasn't. A hand? I'm sorry. No? 800 is the bet from Merson. <laughs> you wish you had Hastings. a hand? I do too. I feel so uh, naked without a hand. One more double up before I get on the plane. That's all I'm looking for. 
<laughs> just one more. Beat up your eyes closed down. You're going to the plane, you said? Oh, yeah. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that? Yeah. Don't Flights are all delayed. Here. And he's been away from the tail about half the time he's been here, too. But yeah, I he's, know. he's getting needled in you for not You know knowing. what they call that? A cheese walk. Yeah, I no kidding. Cheese oh, walk. I'll he keeps running away and, and I'm telling you. talking on the phone. And... What do you do, Robert? Merson's pressure is unrelenting here, but Hastings is going he's nowhere. Trying, he's trying to burn last time. Played a lot at the Bellagio, a little, and some in Tunica, too. Where are you flying to, sir? Southern yeah. Commerce. Yeah. I'm back in the day of the line. Tom, in New York. Where are you flying to? Phoenix. Oh, Phoenix. Hastings checks. Fifty-five hundred. The bet for Merson with Ace High. Definitely is now. What are you trying to do? I'm like. Oof. And Brian Hastings has to let the hand go. Keeping the pressure up worked in that hand for Greg Merson. They're all much better than me now. Wow. Because I travel so much, I don't get to just play on the computer 70 hours a week and like dedicate my life to it. So I, I can't beat them. Williamson raises it to 250. Well, it's a call from I'm going to sleep pretty Joe well. Bucks. I do know that. <laughs> that, that I know. I Choose to that. Yeah, I don't we'll think the sir. people next to me are going to We'll get you some uh, Red Bulls. We'll take care of that for you. Get a couple Red Bulls before you go over. Thanks for the beer, Robert. Welcome. Thank you, Robert. You bet you. A pleasure, gentlemen. A pleasure. Uh, he was playing like 10, 20, 6 in January. And that turns another jack. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he's, he's like one of the few guys. All right, guys, let's get the action going. Here we go, 400 to bet. Because even, even the guys that play super big, like Galfon and Ben, I mean, they just, like, they don't even play no limit. Dude, even the even the really good players, like Ike and, uh, and like, those guys, when they play six max, like, they're not even that good. All the uh, six max. Let me interpret in case you don't Janu, speak. Like Robert Janu Williamson the third. That sound means like, uh, crap. Yeah. All right, I'm all in. All those all in. Sauce, same thing. Once, Once or twice. twice. What we do last time? Twice? Twice. Twice is good. All in and a call. And we will run the river twice. We have seen a bunch of 10K right. plus pods here tonight. Let me try to Poker Night in America. Got some chop outs. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got some chop outs. King eight, queen for a. Deuce. Put up the fifth jack Deuce. and you got a chop out. King. Chop out. Now one more. Now one Push more. Up. Chop and one part. Now one more. The deuce. You don't want a queen? Why don't you call for the queen? queen. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Jeez, I forgot. Yeah. I can, I can you just queen. keep calling for chops. There you go. Oh, well. Now you figure all that. Now you got a map problem. Don't go anywhere. There's more poker yet to come. Poker Night in America is brought to you by DraftKings. Thanks for coming back to Poker Night in America. I'm Chris Hansen. We return to the Feld right now. They did tell us your name was Dump Truck. That's why. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not much difference between a dump truck and a dumpster truck, is it? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Dumpster truck, the back of it comes off. The dump, dump truck stays on the truck. Is that what it is? Yeah. Poker Night in America is brought to you by 888 right. Poker, where the world plays online, and uh, by uh, DraftKings. My straddle, all right. I'm, f I'm uh, 5,000 behind if anybody cares. I'm still 5,000 behind if people don't care. If you'd like to know why I didn't bet the river, sir, I will let you know later. You're a nice guy. Yeah, I'm a very nice guy. That's the Phil tell you I'm a nice guy. I believe Greg, you've confirmed it. Nothing but compliments. Right. I'll tell you one thing. He might be a nice guy. That's been confirmed, but he's not He's not, uh, He's not. not going to give you any money. <laughs> <laughs> if he had the nuts, it would have been a nice size bet in there for you to pay off. <laughs> all right, to let's go. So, all right. You know what, Phil? I'm going to check the in the dark. Was, you know what the fear was? Right. Hey, I'll probably bet in the dark. I know. Go ahead. Yeah, bet in the dark. I can't. I can't. Huh? I'm not that good. There's there's a couple that. people sitting here that... I don't want to give any money to that. He checked everything. Yeah. You thought he was going to check right now? Cash box. I got no. Sir, I will give them to you because I know they're subject to come back. 
You will definitely not marry those chips if you uh, get well, them. I mean, he hasn't, I don't know what you're talking about. Save some for you. He hasn't lost a pot yet. He hasn't lost a pot yet. He just has super coolers and straights. Good Lord. And he moved into me one time. I've just been waiting for like three hours, just patiently, knowing what's coming, but it hasn't happened yet. Joe, what do you think about that? I love it. I'm just trying to get some banter going. We have nothing but time. Keep waiting, sir. Let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It works for him. And when we get done, we'll go have a wow. little drink. Uh, I bet a lot of money he's going to fold that hand within 20 seconds. 20 seconds? I'll take the bet on that. How much? How much? Well, all right, I guess, I guess it has to be a minute. <laughs> <laughs> no. I would have won, see? You would have won. Phil's always right. Yeah, I bet. Show, show the bluff. If you, if you have a bluff, I'll, I'll give you a quarter if you have a bluff. 100 bucks, 100 bucks. 100 bucks. 100 bucks. right there. I'll bet it was a winner. Match it. Anybody want some? Match it. Match it. I'll bet you had the winner. I'll give you a quarter if you show a bluff. I'll bet you had the winner. Wait, wait, you bet he had the winner? Yeah. Okay, I'll bet he didn't. That's my 100, just show the hand. No, no. We have, a, we have a side bet. They have a side bet. I gotta make money off this first. No, because it, it's gonna be on the live stream. Whoever wins will give you a anyway. quarter. Yeah. Pay me for the hand. They're no bad. They have a side bet. Thank you. Yeah. The minute that he said, the minute that he said yeah. out loud, yeah. I want you to fold. I, ah, I was like, God, that's King Queen. Yeah. That's the stone nuts. You, you live in San Antonio? Yeah. I don't. You live in Phoenix. Free restaurants. Phil might be available. Oh, okay. <laughs> Phil, what, uh, what country western stars do you know, Phil? Raised to three on this. Uh, uh, Blake. Uh, Blake Shelton? Yeah. All right. But I think that's about it on CW. That's good enough. You got to hook me up there. Uh, he, he was in Oakland, and I, I brought uh, Jim Harbaugh, who's a country music guy, backstage, and Blake had a good time with us. All right. He's a, he, he's a good guy. Oh, I also met uh, Miranda Lambert. I love uh, Miranda. Married. Now they're married, yeah. Yeah. She was funny. I, I said, I said you going out voice. with with Blake? And she said, said yeah. She She's, said, when was she said, a long I just, time ago. Yeah, a few years back. Yeah, they're married. Right, and so she said, she said, she said, that's some... Um, that son gum better marry me because I just bought the farm right next to his. She was oh, really funny. Right? She was having <laughs> a good time. She's very funny. She's yeah. got an amazing Four voice. One of my, yeah. She's my favorite female singer. Miranda Ryan Lambert? Yeah, yeah. yeah she's, very, she's very good. But she was pretty funny. Just having a good time. I have a song for Blake Shelton. Who are you talking about? Blake Shelton. Uh, I don't know. I want to go on The Voice and have him uh, be my coach. That's don't know the first thing about country get me music. On, you can get me on that, Phil, I'm sure. Robert probably knows some people in country music. I respect Which someone who has a, has a much... song about stealing a parking space, though. Yeah. It's no, much... it's something about... So it's like a really funny country song. I'm just throwing this out there, but I think the song you're thinking of, Phil, is Some Beach. We got a pot One of here, the very gentlemen. first big hits for Blake Shelton. Back to the poker. Turn is a three. Earlier tonight, we saw Greg Merson keep betting, and it was enough to win him a hand when he had nothing. All right, the nothing. name of the song is Psalm Beach. Psalm there Beach. you go, yeah, Phil Helmuth. Yeah. And the video is really clever. That was actually Blake Shelton when he had a mullet, in case you have to know. Psalm, but he says it like son of a... Yeah, right. Psalm. Nothing for Merson on the river. Will he be betting again to try to get another opponent to bowl for the winning hand? It wasn't actually the poker play. <laughs> he won the banger and then picked up Kings. We then I picked up Kings. How many games we played? Check. Five grand. Five, five games. Kings in the straight. He did it earlier to Brian Hastings, and now Robert Williamson III is in the same position. Game, game found. Nice hand. As we wrap up day one here at Maryland Live, Russell Thomas got himself on the green side. Tom Schneider and Joe Butts were already there. And Phil DiPaolo also gets himself up a thousand bucks with some pretty solid play here on Poker Night in America. A game changer. Watch your push on me there. When we come back, it's part two of our trip to the city that has been called the Hollywood for ugly people. Stick around. 
Poker Night in America is being brought to you by 888poker.com, where the world plays online. Hello, I'm Phil Helmuth. We're filming Poker Night in America here in D.C. Poker is a very presidential game. I'm not sure that Washington played, but a lot of other presidents did play in the White House. Well, I mean, within a mile of this capital on any given night of the week, there's probably dozens of poker games going on. You know, members of the staff on the Hill, Capitol Hill, and many elected officials play poker. Uh, members of Congress, other lobbyists from other industries, and even the guys who are sweeping the floors here. There are a fair number of congressmen late at night who, uh, you know, we get some poker chips and, and we play. You know, a big night and you may win 20, and a bad night and you may lose 20. To me, the theme of Poker Night in America in D.C. is poker is presidential. Now, I'm about to walk into a game inside the Beltway. The old hem and haw and re-race, is that what's coming? I don't know. I re-race. <laughs> this is an institution of power and people in power like to play poker, and the two go together. Ulysses S. Grant died broke in part because he was a terrible poker player. Warren G. Harding played poker in the White House twice a week. Richard Nixon financed his first run for Congress with money he won playing poker in the Navy. I mean, this is a city that loves its poker and has a rich tradition of it. And you combine that with power and energy and lots of alpha males running around, you get some juicy stuff going on. These guys are playing poker here. I mean, they have real hands. You told me this was going to be an easy game to beat. <laughs> what happened? They're all good. I mean, come on. For more from Poker Night in America, log on to PokerNight.com or connect with us on Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube, where you can see complete episodes and unedited live streams. Also, be sure to check out our online store for Poker Night shirts, hats, hoodies, and more. For everyone here at Poker Night in America, I'm Chris Hansen.